changes. Alright, right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Inside the Mind of Throne. This is a series where I take you guys into my head and talk through a full live raw game of John Madden football. We're not quite into the gameplay yet. I wanted to show you guys my lineup before we hop into it. I also wanted to mention these videos are a bit more raw. They're a little bit more unedited. And today we're going to be using the new defense that I've been running that has allowed me to go on a 21 game win streak in my head to head. I also went 25 and 0, 24 and 1, and 23 and 2 in my past three weekends of me using this defense. Now the playbook is the New York Giants playbook. I previously ran 4-6. Uh, in 4-6, I could come out in 3-3-5 normal and sub safeties in outside linebacker and then audible down to 3-3-5 wide and have safeties at linebacker where now I only have wide in my playbook. So I have two lurker linebackers. I have Ryan Chazier and Deion Jones, the two fastest lurkers that you can have. And they just play outside linebacker for me in three, three, five wide. And if I click on, they'll still be able to animate on balls. Now, why would I just willingly sacrifice having safeties there? Well, the Giants playbook has one, four, six. Big dime one, four, six was one of the most popular defenses last year. It is so good this year. Now there are some things you can do to counter it. Uh, this year you can sub in, you know, a tight end or a running back out wide and audible down and the safeties will be very slow if you run 146 against you know 21 or 12 personnel however if your opponent chooses to run 11 personnel or if you get them in like a second or third or even fourth and long position you know you can run 146 and not have to worry about them audibling down as much make them pass against it guys 146 is so good i just updated our giants ebook and our tip section on hot route tips that's for members over there it's gonna be linked in the description if you want my offensive and my defensive ebooks head over there just become a member code jags for 10 percent off obviously by the way that means i'm gonna be rocking the jacksonville jaguars offense today but yep giants defense 21 game win streak in my head to head and a 25 and 0 weekend league with this defense i don't know if i have too much more to say if you do learn something today please consider hitting the subscribe button let's get into the game all right getting the ball first i am going to go down i am not going to bring it out i am fully fine with taking the ball on the 25 yard line not on a hash ball carrier conservative uh gun bunch offset guys new ebook is out on hotrod.tips linked in the description code jags for 10 percent off so to start the game i always set my four audibles i like bench pivot z spot and go flood and spacing switch those are the four that i choose to use right now and then i like to come out in deep dig now the only sub i made was i sub derrick henry to halfback so i have him at starting halfback and oh he's running a slot corner on opposite side is this match coverage i think it might be hold up i'm gonna double team this right side i'm gonna try to roll out corner to the to the right side and he's just gonna let me he's just gonna let me just gonna let me a little low ball to Julio Jones I actually probably didn't need a low ball it I could have just racked it and gotten a ton of yards but uh I felt like it was a safer decision for me to rack there okay so I come out and deep digging again like I'm I audible the bench pivot there now we're actually on a hash I'm always gonna keep my bunch on the wide side of the field and then I'm always going to sub Julio Jones to the ISO side that's my playmaker that's my favorite receiver on the field I love Julio Jones that dude's that dude's my guy I love Julio he sends some heat he can't oh he didn't come in but i like to check down right there he didn't really have a flat on the right side i wish i would have thrown it a little bit earlier i was a little bit concerned he got clicked on a d lineman i was concerned that he was gonna be able to get off him and like go make a play now i know this is a defensive video but hey you know i can't choose whether i'm on, whether i'm on offense or or defense first okay i'm gonna run a certain setup here that requires me to come out with the bunch on the short side to start it off i think he's in man I got bagged actually I kind of got super bagged I wonder if my slant was there I didn't really look at it I gotta go for this it's only six yards just refreshing my Lamar stamina he was on yellow now he's on light blue I'd like to get him to normal before we snap this ball okay there's normal all right okay we gotta convert this it's a big down right here six yards how can we get six yards basically in my ebook there's a tell that I can tell whether they're in man or zone before the play even gets snapped this is my play call here hopefully this works snap the damn ball please touchdown 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 I had to I had to I had to air catch it I did not want to risk racking that and gonna get swatted out from behind okay I know I'm yelling touchdown but I need the first down in the first place he, he ran sh uh shaded down me in I kind of expected him to take a deep blue off that side and we were able to get a press win with Andre Johnson and he goes uh he gets over top right there for uh for a nice little a nice little catch love to see it okay let's go to a nice little simple flood can, can an RB get open oh no I almost threw the laser of the century it's a linebacker so he's not going to animate it was just he was caught on Lawrence Taylor so I can just throw it at him it took me just a half second to recognize oh I can just chuck it at him it's a linebacker just let it fly but man I'm an idiot I'm an idiot okay let's let's test out something like I, I actually mm, let's test out something like this just in case we get a press win on the left nope he shaded over top sheds me with a two-man pass rush you hate to see it man you actually hate to see it I'm probably gonna get held to three here damn it I am just gonna go demon time I'm gonna go full demon time I might go for this 
Fourth and 11, in a normal game, I would recommend, I'm gonna call a timeout. Ah! In a normal game, I would definitely recommend uh, not going for this, but dude, I just, I feel like it's demon time. Like, I feel like I gotta go for it. I feel like I have to. I'm just gonna quick snap flood. Probably not the right decision, but I'm gonna do it. Derrick Henry on a wheel got open. Oh my gosh, he didn't have a manned up. That ended up being perfect. I was like, ah, I'll put a wheel just in case. If it's like match and maybe like he won't, he won't end up getting matched on to. And this dude, Derrick Henry is open for a perfect first down. Actually so lucky. Okay, I'm gonna just quickly check down to Henry here in air truck. Damn it, he drops it. Ah, oh, damn it, Henry. That play was bagged in the first place. Probably shouldn't have done that. On the four yard line, you should probably be audibling down to fullback uh, or going to fullback dive and just hammering the ball with Derrick Henry a few times. It's probably what you should be doing. I, he's in zone, so like I'm gonna, I kind of, oh shoot. Why I was open, why I was a TD. I've missed so many players this game. It's been so rough out here, man. It's been so rough. Oh man, I'm hot ass. Oh my gosh, I'm garbage. 15 yard line, this is probably too tight for me to throw this, but I'm gonna try. Abe is open for a half second there. Man, I'm gonna be held to three. It's fine. I should have only gotten three in the first place. I shouldn't have gotten, I shouldn't have converted the the whatever in long. And we just took a whole quarter with us. All right, it's gonna be up, it's gonna be good. Now we're gonna play some defense. We're in the Giants book on defense. We have lurkers uh, at our outside linebackers for 335 wide. But the main reason is uh, is we want 146. 146 is so good against people that run bunch. And uh, this guy that I'm playing, Nev, runs a pretty good bunch. He actually runs a pretty good bunch, but we're gonna bring 146 onto the field today. We're gonna make him pass against it. And it can get dark. It can get really dark, even for people that are pretty good uh, at passing the ball. 146 is really, really tough. So I'm gonna sub Tyran Matthew to, I might even do the slot corner. I'm gonna do it. And then I'm gonna put Ramsey uh, uh, up top, ideally. And then I have my three El Toros on the defensive line right here. Let's do it. Let's get after it, man. Let's go. I love running 146. Makes me feel like last year. I loved 146 last year. I ran it for the entirety of the year. I ran it from August all the way, almost July, all the way through the next July. Because the, the next Madden came out in a, like in August. It was a 13-month Madden. And we're going to scream at him first play of the game. This is where life is about to get miserable for you, Nev. It's about to get just absolutely miserable, buddy. And this is the point of the video where I want to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, Manscaped. Guys, if you're not already familiar with Manscaped, they've sponsored me in the past. They're the world's first all-in-one men's brand dedicated to below-the-waist grooming and hygiene. Now, I absolutely love their products. And behind me, you can see their all-in-one performance package kit, which features their skin-safe lawnmower 3.0, the Crop Preserver Ball Deodorant, the Crop Reviver Refreshing Spread. You're going to get their stainless steel Shears 2.0 nail kit, and of course, one of my favorite products, one that I use all the time, the Weed Whacker, their ear and nose hair trimmer. Now, in addition to providing the right tools for safe and easy manscaping, Manscaped has also partnered with the Testicular Cancer Society for the month of April. If you don't know, April is Testicular Cancer Awareness Month. And that's why I wanted to take a quick second to talk about men's health issues that are important to me. Now, one man every hour, every single day is diagnosed with testicular cancer. And that's why Manscaped has teamed up with the TCS in order to raise awareness, as well as give support to the fighters, survivors, and families affected by testicular cancer. And that's why it's super important to me that you head over to manscaped.com slash TCS and learn to check yourself for early signs of cancer. And you can also share their funny educational video in order to help save lives and balls. And as always, if you want to purchase any of Manscaped's products, you can head over to manscaped.com slash throne for 20% off plus free international shipping. And that's going to be linked in the description below. Thank you so much to Manscaped for sponsoring this video. And let's get right back into it. Especially for the people that didn't pass against 146, which is a lot of people. And if he doesn't start subbing out a, a tight end or, or running back out wide, it, it's going to get dark. It's going to get really hard for him to pass uh, on, on 146. You know, I can send guys off either side. Oh, he's actually going to flip on me. Probably a good late flip, to be honest. Now we got our defense set up in time. He gave me a little bit too much time. Running back's going to be taken care of. We got to come up. We got to hit Randall. We got to hit Randall. Where the f*** is my rock? Where is my rock? Holy hell, game. Jeez, man. That's <laughs> that's really bad. All right, Madden. It's fine. Um, This is my first time I'm going to send. I'm going to send five of them right here. It's my first time doing it. I'm going to even bring down this safety, Justin Reed, right here. Beautiful. Lurking on Minka Fitzpatrick. I really don't mind. Oh, I gotta, I gotta make sure we bring Tyrion back in and get back on Fitzpatrick. Beautiful, beautiful. We didn't scream though. But we were able to get, uh, we were able to get someone to come off the edge in the contain. He's probably got a punt. Fourth and nine. He might go for it. I'm thinking we send the dogs. I'm thinking it's the first time we send six. If we, yeah, we're gonna send six here. Let's do it. Let's do it. No. And he quick hiked me. And we picked him. Is it a pick six, Darius? Get out, Slay. 
When I'm on conservative on offense, the dude is going to run with both of his hands on the ball, okay? So you have to stunt or do some sort of ball carrier move to get him out of it, and then you're actually gonna run normal speed. And we were able to come flying in even though I got quick hiked. Honestly, pretty good decision by him to send out five and just try to quick hike me. It's just, you know, my pressure came in so fast. He threw out a sack and he didn't even have many routes that were going to the first down marker. So like, you know, if it was a shorter yardage, situ a shorted yardage situation, he probably would have been fine. But um, yeah, I definitely got quick hiked, but we ended up coming in free. Beautiful. Okay, 10 nothing. 10 nothing. We just need one stop and the game's basically over. He just told me he's going to go to 2 1 2 personnel, which honestly he should have done earlier. He should have gone to, actually, sorry, he's going to go to. He's going to go to 12 personnel. He should have done it earlier. Like, um, it, it is very hard to pass on 146. So, like, the the thinking behind subbing in somebody out wide like that, like a tight end out wide, like he has Ingram out wide to the right now, is he can audible down to, like, deuce close or, like, a two tight end set and run the ball, and it'll weak box my safeties. That's the thinking behind that. We actually still screamed. Our El Toro came in. But, like, it's going to be a lot harder for me to play defense out of 3 5 wide. Like, I have some lurkers, outside linebacker. Like, 1 4 6 is way harder to play against. But it's second and 20 now. I can go to 1 4 6. If he wants to choose to run the ball on a down like this, that's fine. I can go to 1 4 6 here and feel pretty decent about myself. Like, I, I don't think, even if he, like, popped a run for 15 yards, it'd only be third and five. And we could just go back to wide, or we can even try 1 4 6, keep Matthew on the contain right there. Beautiful, beautiful. Can we scream? We didn't scream. He picked it up. And I lurked him. I lurked him. I lurked it like it was a playmaker, and he threw it anyway like a regular drag. Damn it. 3rd 11. I am going to stay in 146. Again, he could audible down. Like, that's what, I, like, if anyone uh, brought 146 onto my field, I would just audible down. Like, I would sub Vernon Davis out wide. Uh, often I talk about how I like Vernon. And we screamed at him. I sent six. And uh, an audible down to deuce close stretch. And just, you know, I'm not going to let you run 146 on me. It's just a miserable experience. And that's why I'm putting out an entire, you know, video on this defense. Like, the ways to counter it, though, you sub a tight end, sub a running back out wide. Don't let that, like, or like audible down on, on normal downs against it. Okay. Man, I have struggled to talk this game. I feel like I have just struggled to talk. That's what happens when you wake up and you try to record. It's not going to be the easiest thing in the world. All right, can we get an offensive seven, please? See, now, I don't know what is what he's trying to accomplish here, but we're going to... Wow, Playmaker is so damn good. Playmaker is so freaking good. Oh, wow. Six AP, just the best six AP you can spend. Like, think about that right there. Like, I probably could have scrambled and gotten a few yards, but, like... My life becomes so much easier when I'm able to just playmaker uh, back like that. Oh, it's awesome. All right. I think he's in match again. I don't know why he comes out with a slot corner on the short side sometimes. He does this occasionally. It doesn't make sense. He's like, he's a better Madden player than that. Like, wow, playmaker actually going crazy again um, than him to do that. Like, I don't understand it, but I like it. Like, what you want is you want your slot corner on the side or on the strong side of the formations. Like, right here, the slot corner is, you know, lined up uh, right above the point man in bunch. Like, that is ideally what you want. I'm probably just going to air truck with Henry here. Nope. Ah, oh, I didn't get the pass off in time. Wow. I'm a broken play master. I'm a broken play specialist. I'm a broken play specialist. A little fake scramble, roll out, get him to send the spy and throw it over it. Beautiful. Derrick Henry, touchdown. Another playmaker. I just playmakered three times for, for every completion of that drive. And I'll gladly take it. And that's fine. Nev and I actually had a really good game in seasons when we played. So that's why I was like, I hit him up. I was like, ah, we could have a really good game for a video. We had a really, really good game. It came down to one of the last possessions in the in the fourth quarter. But right now he's you know he's struggling on offense against one four six. And then the one time I ran wide, I screamed at him. So like yeah, it's it's gonna make life a little bit more difficult when you are playing against one four six more down, most downs. I'm actually gonna send pressure here out of wide, and I protect the sti protected the sticks. Keep Justin Reed back. And I almost got to it. I almost freaking lurked it. Man, my my Ronnie Lot just went crazy right there. He's going to do the classic no huddle. He knows he got away with throwing something wild. I'll go offsides. I think he screwed up. I don't know. It's etiquette. Like, he he didn't mean to get the false start. So, like, right here. So, he's coming out with his bunch on the short side. Short side. Perfectly fine, right? I have my zone drop set. Curl flats at five. That's why they're, they're basically going to play like card flats right now. I'm going to flip it the second he flips his bunch. You see a lot of people do that. Like, you need to be flipping with the bunch. Oh, that post actually got open. Dang. I thought it was going to be a corner out. I thought he was flooding the left side. Good play. I got to keep him in bounds here. He's only got two timeouts, so flip it again. I don't know if I like this defense. I'm literally just double mabling. I 
Any broken plays me all the way up to the... We really can't allow seven here. That's the big thing. He gets ball at half. I can't allow seven. If he gets seven somehow, my life's... You know, I'm going to be in a hard spot. I am going to go to 146 right here. You know, it's a, an opportunity for us to sack him out of field range. If he wants to audible down and waste, you know, he basically gets like one play or two plays. He's going to motion over. Make sure Matthew's right there. Beautiful. I don't like that spot Sherman's in right now, though. I don't know if he's going to scream or not. And we, now we scream. Now he doesn't have timeout. So, like, he could spike if he wanted to. He's actually... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. This is bad for him. This is bad. Yeah, okay. He's going to take us three. So, he's just going to be down 14 and a half. What a weird half. What a weird half of Madden. Oh, my gosh. That was an odd half. So, it's going to be his ball. And I come out with one more stop. I'll come out in wide. Unless he gets, you know, in a long yardage second down or, or a third or fourth down. Then I'll come run 146 and just kind of beg him to audible down. If he wants to audible down, that's fine. You can pop runs. Keep in mind, it is very easy to pop runs. Oh, he barely squeaked that kick in. He actually barely squeaked it in. All right, man. One more freaking stop. I think we're going to go to a little bit of match this drive. Let's do it. And people ask every single time, what is match? Match is cover four quarters or cover four palms. In 335 wide, it's literally just called cover four show two. Uh, it's not drop show two. If it's a drop, it would be a drop coverage. It wouldn't be match. But this is this is match. The biggest thing to keep in mind is you want to be deep having the side of bunch or else you can get bombed pretty easily, actually. I got to run with this post here. I tried to fake peel off. Okay, he gets the ball off. I really just can't get bombed. I'll even move Darius Slay off. You can get a press win over there and it can it can actually like be a one play touchdown or like or you can rack it downfield. Like it's similar to, you know, if they shade it underneath and played man. Ah, oh, his crosser's going to get open. Play it, Ramsey. It's not a crosser. It's a deep post. Beautiful. Let's go. Let's go. My linebackers did something. Dion. No, Dion Jones. I was going to say, Dion Jones, your ass. Whoever swatted it, Dion Jones comes in, makes a play. It's a flood. All right, we're going to re. We're going to play one more. Well, damn it. I'm getting ball first. It's fine. It's fine. Damn it, come here. I need a TikTok clip. Let me go viral. Oh, wait. Last video I literally, or last game I literally talked about. Guys, don't bring the ball out. Don't do it, okay? It's bad. I'm on the 15-yard line. I'm, I'm on a hash, but at what cost? 10 yards, okay? Set your audibles. Set your subs. Make sure Derrick Henry's a halfback. Make sure you're on conservative. Don't want to be fumbling and definitely don't want to be sack fumbling, okay? And people have been asking how I truck on conservative. Basically, right when I catch the ball, I rack it and I do the ball carrier move, whether it's a truck or a juke or a spin, whatever it is, it's typically a truck. And then you're not going to fumble still, and you have access to still being able to air truck or do whatever. Now, he's in man coverage here, and I... I'm going to try to be a little slimy loser since he's in man. I don't want to let him play man. I don't want to let him play man. X is a touchdown. 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 Get out, Julio. 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 I love that guy. I love him. He's one of my favorite receivers in the game. I knew he was going to be in man. Right there it is again. Same thing. He shades underneath and he got rid of that deep blue. He put it inside third instead. I, I got such a big press win that I was just able to bullet pass it. You see how big we won on that press? Uh, you, you don't win like that very often. You'll win like that, I don't know, maybe 5% of snaps. It's not often at all. Typically, it, you'll have to lob it and pretty much, you know, possession catch it. And an inside third might even get over to almost play it. But right there, yeah, no, we were able to bullet pass it and take it for seven. I'll take that. So, gonna get the personnel set from 146 and for 335 wide. I would assume he's not gonna let me run 146. I personally wouldn't either. I would I would not let anybody run, run 146. I've said it before. Sub a tight end, sub a running back out wide, audible down. Literally run the ball. If they're in 146, run. Do not let them, do not let them run. He's in, he's in 11 personnel. I'm going to, I'm gonna do it. Like, it's like he forgot. It's like he forgot. Ah, oh, he ran the ball. He ran the ball. Damn it. Okay. Um, there are easy ways to shoot uh, 146 that I go over in my ebook. It's most helpful if you really know they're running. You kind of have to have it really on your radar that they're going to be running the ball. Then you can shoot it. But like if you're setting up normal pass events, it could be hard to stop both the run and the pass. But I have an inside stuff. Uh, you know, against Bunch, they don't have an inside zone or anything. It's just a read option and a, a base. I mean, he's going he's gonna to stick in it. All right. He's flipping the Bunch. We'll flip with him. And he's going to run the ball again. Hey, I respect it. I respect it. It's just now he's on a, a third and whatever. I would much rather see him you know, sub a tight end or a running back out wide and audible down and actually have a shot to crib a run. You're not going to crib a base. You're not going to crib a halfback base. And there it is. He's, he's going to 2 one two now. And I have to make the decision, do I want to stick in in one four six or wide? I'll go to wide. I think I would normally rather be in one four six, but I'll go to wide here. I'll play along. This place should be bagged. We just got to take this post. Ugh, I'm running with it. Lot. 
Good job. Okay. Whenever, whenever you see a tight end post or a, or a wide receiver post or crosser, you just got to freaking run with it because it, it destroys match. You got to be careful of this. Okay. Here we go. Now I'm going to 146. It's fourth and six. We can get off the field early again. It'd be great. Is he going to flip his bunch? Okay. He did. I'm not going to flip with him. I am just going to. The running back goes on a route. I have to run at the running back. I've got nobody on that right side. It's not. I manned him up just to try, and I even shaded underneath and inside, just to try to stop a post right there. That was literally what I tried to stop. So I was like, man, if he's on a post, he can probably just, you know, easily get a bunch of yards. I'm, I'm going to have to lurk to the left. And no, it's a good play by him. He's played pretty poorly on offense compared to the way he played last time. So, I mean, I'll, I'm sure it'll turn around here at some point, but. Make a tackle. This Camara's breaking tackles. I feel like everybody's Camara just absolutely eats my ass. Like the dude just breaks every single tackle, known to man. I'm gonna come out like this. Let's see if he uh let's see if he'll audible. Will he flip? Oh, I'm in the wrong defense, dude. That was really bad defense. That was very bad. That was really, really bad. I didn't set my audibles out of wide. So when I audibled back to cover three, it went to cover three buzz and not Mike Mike Blitz three. And I couldn't get in a match either. That was really annoying. That was my fault. Yep, he's gonna come out with his bunch flipped every single time. He's gonna make me flip. It's smart. There goes the crosser. Is he going to chuck it? Is he going to let it fly? Make a play, Clowny. This dude, Clowny, tried to play it in a three rep, then he just stopped, man. I got Lurker on Clowny. Let him go crazy. Let him go crazy. I dropped him into coverage out of match, so I put Lurker on him, just in case he needs to go crazy. If I can click on him, maybe make a play. I'm going to move off. Awesome. Wah. I don't expect him to streak him anytime soon, but just to be careful. I've got to keep up with this. Shaz, damn it. That's the hard part about having wide is I have linebackers and man on the tight end. You know, if I, if I had normal to wide, if I had like safeties there, I could bag that pretty easily and, or a lot more easily rather. And nope, that is not, just doesn't work out with my personnel. I'm going to run match in the 11. It's not a bad time to run match. Match or man, both are good. My DB just mount made a hell play this Justin Reed. I lurked super low to try to get him to throw a pick, and he actually made a good read, and he threw out a sack. Oh, I love a good throw out a sack in my favor. He goes to I-form slot. I didn't get time to set up my defense, but it's fine. I had my slot corner over there, so I was like, he probably can't run it at it. Let me just take away the RPO. So I just literally lurked on the, on the safety right there just in case. Third and eight. I don't know what... What would like, it's gotta be like flood, right? I, I don't know what other play you can go to here. He's in saddle. He could go to clear out or something. He's going to go to bunch to end. Hmm. This worries me. This worries me. Let's do this. I probably should have put an inside third, but I didn't. Oh, wow. That did it get open. Cheat him. Why'd he highball it? Why'd you highball it? It's wide open. Oh, I just got so lucky to hold him to three. That's actually so incredibly lucky. I've gotten really lucky these games. I'll gladly take it. I'll gladly take some fluke. T TGL, team get lucky. Now I've got it in the three letters, but I will gladly take it. All right, let's go get seven. I didn't even have to work last drive. I was so confused what that tight end was on. It just ended up being like a super deep out route or something. I am not bringing the ball out. I will take my advice. I will just go down. Okay, 25 yard line. Perfect. It's fine that I'm not on a hash. Totally cool with it. I'm just assuming this is just match. Like I'm just going to quick... Oh, that's why we got a 99 speed pocket running back at quarterback. The dude just gets out. I love Lamar Jackson. Oh my gosh. People have been asking like, who's better? Who's there? Who's the best quarterback in the game? Today? I still think it's Lamar. Lamar is so freaking good. Love Lamar. I don't know what I'm doing here at this play call, but we'll make it work. I think I can't throw a B right there. This spy would have played it because I rolled out to the right. Uh, I would have had to stay in the pocket and I had to run. Damn it. 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 I got bagged by match right there. This should be a good play call. We'll see though. Oh, he blitzed. Laser, 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 laser. George Kittle, George Kittle, George Kittle. Let's go. It's actually only the second time I think I've thrown that bench pivot route. Like this dude, this dude Kittle, I love him. And then obviously I've, I, I'm gonna say it for the 25th time. Like people are gonna keep, you know, asking how do you beat 146? I wish I knew how to pass on it better. I really, really don't. But I will say, that you can always just sub Vernon Davis or George Kittle out wide. Like, that's the reason why I run a Niners theme team. I want... I'm bagged right here. You can make a play on the on the run, though. Yep, there it is. 
That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, Kittle. That's what I'm freaking talking about. I didn't even try to get sticky. I just ran right into the defender. Damn it. Is I want the 298 speed guys. Okay, in Jags, I have Deuce Close to audible down to. I just put Vernon Davis out. He's a 98 speed, basically perfect wide receiver. He's literally the man. Okay, so I don't have to play at any sort of a disadvantage. You're going to have to run wide against me. Okay, or else I'll audible down. I will run stretch and dive. And I'll punt if I have to. Okay, I will. I don't want to play one against 146. And most people, though, they're not going to be stubborn. If they see you're in 12 or 21 personnel, they're just, they're going to say, you, you got it, man. Uh, no need to. No need to test you. I don't know what play call I'm doing right here, but I'm just kind of going with it. I think I'm going to roll out and throw to RB. It's not open. Good click on by him. Throw it away. That wasn't open. I could have probably thrown B. I threw to X. I threw to X. I threw to X. I swear. Hold up. That's the most good. It didn't even say inaccurate. Did I click the wrong button? Oh, X is Julio. Yeah, no, I threw to the wrong guy. I was staring at B though. No, or RB. That's who I was staring at. Man, I'm an idiot. Wow, that was really, really bad. That's actually one of the worst things I've ever done in a video. And we're just going to keep it in it. I mean, I, I can't can't get rid of it. Like, it's, just, it's in the video. I'm an idiot. That is really bad by me. Like, really, really bad. I'm kind of glad I was wrong though, because I would I would have gone crazy. Pick it, pick it, pick it, Justin Reed. Yeah, just now, just let him ag me, just let him dunk on me, like just let him throw 45 yard alley oops, man. Holy crap! No, stop! I'm not letting you slip in 11 personnel. I know I'll notice it instantly, you freaking moron. Pick it. Nice. Good stuff, man. Game's going very well for me right now. I'm gonna lurk on Justin Reed right here. Oh, he ran the ball. I mean, I respect the play call. I've got a safety. I was able to come up and blow up the run pretty easily, but like he's got he's only got one timeout now. Like if he runs, it's honestly fine. He's just the clock is super against him with only one timeout. No, 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 no. Don't slip don't slip that personnel out there now. Not now. Good read. Ah, uh, damn it. Really? So what I'm going to do if I have to be in a position to stop the run like this, I'm going to spy my safeties. And he, he's just going with streaks. That's fine. He actually had a touchdown on the right side, but it's cool. He actually got a lot of yards. We tackled him in bounds. He only has one timeout, so. He's got to play like perfect right here. I'm going to do the exact same thing. Just come out. One, four, six. Oh, he's just quick snapping. Nice, dude. That's picked. This has been a drive of of his freaking life. He's had an awesome drive. He's played great. Intentional grounding. Accept it. All right, it's going to be up. It's going to be good. It's going to be his ball. Uh, he's only down one. could have no oh i was the i'm the best i'm actually the best did i screw this up there's no way i don't think i could have scored henry got hawked down i don't know if i can make him miss there please tell me that it wasn't my fault please tell me it wasn't my fault yeah that's like you can't make a person because you can't stop and go and make a miss from behind there i didn't think i could stop i thought i had to try to outrun him but yeah no that blows Oh, I would have gone so viral on TikTok. I actually would have just gone the most viral you've ever seen. Oh, no. He just DM'd me, said I almost got put on TikTok. Hell yeah, you did. Hell yeah, you did. Oh, it's fine. All right, we, we just got to get a stop. He is trying to throw the, the ball to me repeatedly, okay? We just need one stop. I got to run match. Again, this video is on 146, but he's not really letting me run 146, which is fine. Bag. How do you take that sack? That's a terrible... Th Dude, I do that sometimes, though. I do take sacks that are kind of similar. But that's a really bad one to take. Like, he, saw, he had a long time to see that shed. I mean, his eyes must have been just not even close to looking in that area. And honestly, I should run 146 on this down. I really should. But instead, I'm just going to... I'm going to lurk as far left as possible. You're not beating me with a poster or a crosser. Like, this crosser, I'm running with it. 
You can play maker up. It's fine. Bagged. I'm the best. I'm the best. I'm the best. Yeah. Give me my rightful turnover. Give me the. Give me my rightful turnover. I'm the best. You send them. You click on and you go make a play. Like <laughs> you. You just played right into my freaking hand. I love. I love people like that. I love people like that. He's never seen someone do that. He's never seen someone make a play like that. Now I'm gonna turn the ball over. I'm talking too much. Damn it. Yeah. Uh, I'm trying not to turn the ball over in these situations, and I'm just freaking getting, just getting bagged. I don't think I'm gonna get anything open here, man. I can't even lie. Oh, laser. My tight end posted. Nice. Ah, I love to see it. That's exactly what I was talking about. You know, if they run match, you know, the tight end posts, tight end crossers are so good against quarters or palms. And that was palms right there. And we just torched it. All right, I will gladly be up a... And, and for you guys who made it later in the video to see me with that play before half, oh, you got a treat. You got a treat for making it this far. If you're enjoying the content, please consider hitting the subscribe button, guys. Thank you for coming out and, uh, and supporting the channel. It's a late night upload. This is a super late night upload. I had to get this video out tonight. Oh, Henry. Henry. Henry, Henry, Henry. Could have made the could have made the play of the freaking year. And dude, this is where I love to get a little a little user pick. My my Ronnie Lot is uh is is lighting. He's glowing orange. Now, granted, it wasn't a super user. Oh whoa, good play. Hold up, I was talking too much. It's gonna be a TD. Can we get a stop on the one yard line, man? Can we hold the freaking door? There's no way he's no huddling this. This is a horrible decision. That's a horrible call. Wow, that is inside the mind of a freaking moron. What the hell are you doing? That is a really bad play call. Wow, okay, I'm gonna go to Big Nickel, so I'm not gonna allow him to audible down. That's really bad. <laughs> yeah, if he scores here, regardless, that play call was really, really bad. I don't even know what I'm doing here. This actually isn't very good defense, to be honest. And he just lost more yards. He just went backwards on two consecutive plays on the goal line. He was on the one yard line. Now he's on the eight. I'm not running run defense now. Now I just, I'm, I'm just running wide. I'm a little bit worried about my defense. I think I'm going to screw up. We just bagged him. We actually just played perfect. Oh, <sighs> these drives have been actually insane. I feel like I've gotten so many stops in these couple games and I've, <laughs> I'm in a, you know, a five point game with them. That's rough. It is what it is though. That's Madden. You know, they'll throw the ball at you and you won't get stops. I do it to people all the time, man. I do it to people all the time too. And we almost got seven before half with the play of the year. It just would have been the play of the freaking century. I'm not bringing this out. We'll be smart. To be honest, I haven't really had to play offense in these games. I feel like I have not played like any offense at all. He's in over G right now. I'm just assuming this is palms. I'm just gonna. I mean, I just got to be better, man. Should have lowballed it when it was open the first time. I shouldn't have been like, hey, no, I've got a ton more yards. This is going to be brilliant. Let me just play maker and get a billion gazillion yards. I knew he was going to click on right there. So I was like, yeah, let me. Oh, wow. Now I took a hit stick. Now I'm the moron. It's fine, though. Oh, my freaking gosh. It's annoying. It's annoying. It's annoying. Where are you throwing, Lamar? I just threw to A. I'm four for nine for 159 yards. How is that even possible? It's because he's dark blue. I should have I should have checked my stamina. I should have known he was tired. He just got lit up. Gosh dang it, man. I'm an idiot. Does he have like deflators or enforcers? I didn't even check his abilities. Inside the mind of a freaking. It's not a TD. It's an odd quarter. I think I beat him. I did. Nah, I thought it was an Iraq Agam right there. Sub out Kittle, sub in Vernon Davis. This idiot's gonna, he's gonna user rush me off the, oh, well, I'm just gonna wheel Y then, it's fine. He blitzed me off both sides and I got an intentional grounding. Damn it, am I actually bagged now? Am I, no, no, I'm not bagged. No, 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 I'm not bagged. Should I go for this? No, no, you shouldn't go for this ever. But sometimes why the hell not? I almost converted it. <laughs> I'm four for 11 for 160 yards. How's that even like a normal? How is that a stat line? It so easily could be five for 11 for like 210. If my Julio doesn't let the ball hit off his back. Oh, wow. I'm lurking on a mid read. That's really bad by me. All right. All right. Well, the good thing is you can't move the ball. The bad thing is I'm just, I've lost my mind over here. I've, I've very much lost my mind. If this is two crossers, I'm screwed.
Thank God. I'm going to beg him to audible down here. Let's do it. I haven't done this in a minute. Mm, hit him, dude. Damn it. That was exactly where I wanted to lurk. I wanted to lurk up the seam. Uh, I need my safety to come down and just crack his skull in. I need him to drop that. I really can't allow three here. I will actually... My brain's going to explode if I allow three here, by the way. Like, I'm, I'm actually going to be really on tilt. I was going to say, I think he might be passing. <sighs> you see people just like audible down and then do a couple hot routes. They're probably passing. Like, I only spied one safety. Spy safety is against the run, man. That's what we do. He just threw me another fucking pick. That's my 19th billion pick. And now my face cam is frozen. All right, my OBS just crashed and it, it's fine now. My face cam capture software. And it's fine now, so we're just gonna we're just gonna play on. I thought I just lost my entire recording. I was gonna be so upset. Can we bag this, please? Ah, I probably should have just clicked on and went for a strip. Why not try to strip it from him? All right, we're winning. That's his, this is going to be his fourth field goal when he's turned the ball over 19 times total, and he's only had to pay for probably two of them. It's actually insane. Meanwhile, I am like. Four for 11 passing for 160 yards. This second game is probably one of the weirder games of Madden you will ever see on my channel. Like, this is actually a wild game. And I'm cool with it. I'm cool with it. All right, we need a few first downs. He has two timeouts, three minutes left. Uh, I kind of wanted to get on a hash since he's you know, running a little bit of a weird, like, big nickel use rush defense. But it's it should be fine. I shouldn't be bagged by this. I had a play where I gained 50 billion yards. Okay, now he's changing his defense. I don't know why he does this. Why does he... When he goes to match, why does he do this? I don't get it. And I'll just throw it on the run. Lamar, 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 Lamar. Oh, yeah, Lamar threw an inaccurate ball last <laughs> last drive when he was tired. But to be fair, I also headbutted a hit stick. Those are the things that, that the media won't tell you. All right, I'm probably going to audible to a run right here. I probably will. Oh, he tripped. Oh, that's so lucky. Please don't be a first down. I want this to be inches. I really want it to be inches. Yes. I got a fullback dive here. Yes. That's okay, though. That's okay, though. Henry, we get it that time? I, I want to get it that time. Okay, we did. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And it goes to the two-minute warning. Beautiful. Back to conservative. Now, just like uh, probably one first down, it's GG's. I don't know if this is the right call right here, but I just, I know he's going to use a rush. It's open. See inbounds? Yes. Yes. He tackled me inbounds. That's actually huge. Okay. Oh, I've probably got to pass. I've probably got to pass. Henry, playmaker up field, please. Gotta throw it away. I, I was trying to playmaker Henry the whole time to go up field to get past that flat. Oh my gosh. I need one first down to win, dude. I just put out a horrible play on the field. Awful. It's my fault. It's a lot of yards. Oh boy. Now it's sweaty. Oh wait. No, no, no. I can kick from here. I can kick from here, but oh, I'm a bad kicker. I'm actually a bad kicker. I can't even lie, guys. I'm a really bad kicker. I don't have focus kicker. And uh, okay, we're gonna we're gonna play it smart. We're gonna play it smart. We're gonna chew this clock. I'm gonna test to see how far I can kick from with acres. It's gonna have to be perfect. There's no win. Okay, I'm gonna call timeout with one second, and we're gonna hammer a run at him. Actually, no, I might pass. Oh, I don't know. Do I pass? Do I run? What do I do here? What do I do here? Laser touchdown. I'm gonna go down. GG's. Oh, okay. Thankfully, he didn't have it inside third. GG's, man. G freaking G. Oh my gosh, I just fought my freaking heart out to win that game. That was insane, guys. If you enjoyed the if you enjoyed the video, rather, please consider hitting the subscribe button again. Both my offensive and defensive ebooks are gonna be on hot route tips. Nev's pretty good. Nev actually is pretty good. I feel like he got pretty lucky in the second game, particularly. But um. Yeah, no, I, that was an interesting game of Madden. That was very interesting. Again, thank you to Manscaped for sponsoring the video. I'll see you guys in the next one.